Did you know that depending on the day that you were born, there are different crystals that is good for you? I'm a crystal expert and this citrine is probably good for you. You're born in the month of June and you don't have rose quartz, you're missing out big time. You're born in January and your manifestation is not working, you probably need an amethyst. The best part about this is you don't have to worry about a thing because I'm Sal, I'm a crystal expert and I will make your custom crystal bracelet based on your birthday for free. Visit my website, eatreadlove.me. Leos, mark this day and mark this reading as Saturn goes retrograde in your seventh house. If you have an unfinished business with someone that you, I don't know what you want to call it, soulmate, twin flame, spouse, girlfriend, boyfriend, whatever you want to call it, they will come back if it's unfinished business. But if they don't, they're not coming back. You guys are done. Five months. Five months. June to November. Mm -hmm. hmm. Now did I get your attention? Yes, Sal, because I will change my phone. <laughs> we'll see. Oh, we are manifesting love. <laughs> I can't, I can't, I, I'm not supposed to do my other laugh. I have a, I have a, I have a private laugh. <laughs> Get two cups. Someone comes back. <sighs> mm. You'll be manifesting, right? Saturn is seventh, of course. This is not, well, you know, it was tough. It's, uh, it's, uh, it takes a while. But Saturn in the seventh is a karaka. 100% guarantee. If Saturn in the seventh, relationship. Any planet in the seventh guarantees a relationship. 100% without a doubt. Mm -hmm. Now, the kind of relationship that you're getting is a different story. I didn't say it's going to be like, whoa, <laughs> you see that? Saturn requires work. I feel like you're, you're a natural fifth house. Leos are naturally hopeless romantic. Sometimes take out the romantic, just hopeless. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You guys, you guys are going to stay for sure with the two of cups right here. No one is going. You're not even going to blink. Mm -hmm. You're going to blink. Mm -hmm. At this point, you're going to clock out and you're going to go on a lunch break. Yes, because <laughs> you and I have a lot to discuss. Okay. Is it a fire sign? Oh, Ten of Pentacles. I see they have a lot of money. Sal, you, you got me there. <laughs> Why not? Why not? Why are we going to be with the broke bloke? Mm -mm. No, Sal. Give me the Ten of Pentacles. Long-term partnership. They're fun. Give me younger fire sign. You're in love with them. They're in love with you. Good. Um, I feel like this person can be an artist, musician like that. They have a good following. People like your person. Very charismatic. Um, good family. Comes from good family. Man. This person is, I have to say, they're pretty cool. Okay. I really say, I don't even use the word cool, but that's what it's giving. It's giving tattoo. Because <laughs> people with tattoo, people think they're cool. I'm boring as F. Okay. Um, two of cups right here. You just jive with this person. You get excited seeing them. Mm -hmm. But here's the thing. Knight of Wands. They're... They're there, but not yet, like, you know, there's no formality yet. Mm -hmm. So it's fun until you develop feelings, and then now you're going to ask, of course, um, you know, are you guys together? What are we? You know, like, what are we? <laughs> well, I feel like we could just have fun. Why not? Right? Mm. For me, what's the use of a label? I don't know. Now that's, that's me. I don't do labels at all. Hmm. It doesn't do anything. Ashish. Why people are calling? Okay, well it's my it's my best friend. <laughs> okay, it's my best friend. Okay. Let's see here. Oh okay. Mm-hmm. I see it here. Okay. We have an Eight of Swords, Seven of Swords, uh, the Eight of Wands. I feel like your person is playing with fire. What you don't know won't hurt you. Mm hmm Yeah. And this is the part of the Saturn now in retrograde. They can come back, but of course, it doesn't mean again. Like, it's going to be a fairy tale story. In the stationary time of Saturn, okay, 
the next, the five days before the 29, it's going to be very, very before and after. And then same thing as November 15, before and after five days, because that's when it gets uh, stationary. It's uh, It can change things all of a sudden, okay? Like this one. Oh, it's good. We, we actually talked. We went out. It was having fun. You know, we were just cool with each other. And the next thing you know, eight of swords with the seven of swords. Okay. Look at this. Mm -hmm. There's something that you've been meaning to ask them, to talk to them with the eight of swords. And then, the, and then they avoid you. And then now you're going to be like, I thought we were cool. Did I, you know, I didn't understand it. I don't understand what happened there. Mm. So it left you basically questioning. So, <clears throat> okay. Let's see. Mm. Let's see. Okay. Whew. Got a soulmate card again. That's a temperance. Ah. Uh. You have, is it a Cancerian? Is it a Sag? It's giving Cancerian Sag, okay? I don't know. I don't know placement. But the Temperance is a card of like, you got to meet them halfway, which means, I don't know, if they're not ready to settle, you have to be accommodating of that. All right? But I'm not saying that you should, but that's how they run the terms. Uh, I don't know what the halfway for them is. It's just like, okay, we can be together. I'm not going to date anyone, but I really don't do titles. Does it make sense like that? You know, some people like that. Mm. You know, it, for whatever reason, your person gets uh, cold feet. You know, it's like runaway bride. I don't know. If you want marriage, you know, it's like, all right, they got cold feet and they're gone. Every time it gets serious. Oh, there it is. So I got, that, that's what I'm seeing here. Every time, okay, things become serious, your person basically just bounce. And then, you know, like they, um, they, um, faster than basically a speeding bullet, they're gone. One of the custom personalized intention bracelet that I did was for this lovely, lovely soul who was asking for a protection bracelet for their lovely relationship. And it was actually the strawberry full moon. So I made it sure that it's looking like strawberry. And I put the intention of manifesting love, peace, and harmony in their connection. Find out more how to get your custom free intention bracelet down below. Okay. So seven of swords, they gone. Your person is gone. Temperance, the reconciliation. Back together. Okay. Let's see. Oh, yeah. This was tough for you. You got ten of swords. Very, very tough. It's hard for you to understand or to even think right now because you feel that you were robbed out of a chance for this like you know you thought it is the one okay but i don't think it's over over because you know there is that as a ten of pentacles now if you get your double piao your eight and carrot again i don't know what you're manifesting but you get your custom your mystic bracelet i'll tag in a corner um, for free, uh, like the previous uh, client I did was they wanted something during the strawberry full moon and I did it. And it's for their relationship, for manifesting. Now, if you have something particular that you are manifesting, add it in the notes before you check out, put the intention, the situation, and your birthday. And I'll be more than happy to make one for you for free when you get your double PL. But if you just want the bracelet on its own, the mystic uh, custom um, intention bracelet, you can also get it there. Now, free shipping in the U.S., of course, and we ship to more than 80 countries across the globe. So you can check it out, okay? Because I feel like you are here. Ten of Swords with the Temperance. Manifesting your soulmate. I feel like to speak, talk, you know, don't ghost you. You know, something in something in between, okay? Uh, in, in between those lines. Okay, let's see here. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Got the Hierophant. Hopefully, you guys are not married, and then, you know, your person decides to jump off the wedding, meaning, it's like, because this is the stable partnership that you have been manifesting. It's a Taurus. Okay. But I can tell you this. Nobody's going anywhere. Neither you or them. 
I haven't seen the meaning as far as like what my experience with charts when Saturn is in the seventh, it can last for 20 years, you know, as long. Okay, because it could be the you know, the how do you call it? Ten of Pentacles with the Hierophant, like till death do us part, but no one's dying. But I'm just saying it is marriage material, but it has its ups and downs. Okay, now make sure to put it in the notes when you get your custom bracelet, and tomorrow I'll continue this reading.